new rule applies to indoor businesses like restaurants, bars, clubs, and gyms, and for those who are 12 and older. Our Crowd Force Gail Long uh, spoke to business owners who apparently have some mixed reactions about this mandate tonight. Gail, what are you hearing from them? There is still confusion about the vaccine mandate. One business owner says he didn't even know about it until people started showing their vaccination cards. But overall, it has been working out just fine. It was a packed house at Cesar on Shattuck Avenue in Berkeley Friday night. Business is fine. It hasn't really changed since the mandate started. I think most people are more comfortable uh, knowing that everyone else in the restaurant is vaccinated. Sheris Corey is one of those customers who welcomes a vaccine mandate. I think it's a positive thing. I know that it would, you know, stir some people up who, you know, aren't in favor of that. But I think where we're at with the um, pandemic, that, it, you know, it's a good thing. Last week, the city of Berkeley issued a new order after a spike in the Delta cases. Most indoor businesses like restaurants, bars, clubs and gyms will now require customers to provide proof of vaccination for those 12 and older. I'm feeling great about that. I have absolutely no problem with it. I believe in public health. I feel like public health should be more respected. As of Friday, the new rule is enforceable, but this business owner had no idea. Yeah, some people they show, some people didn't show. I have to find the, what the rule says, you know. And businesses have until mid-October to require proof of vaccination. Reporting from Berkeley, Gail Ong, Cron 4 News. Gail, before we let you go, uh, some of the video that you showed did show customers that uh, were out and about. Uh, how are they reacting to this new mandate? Well, it's been about a week, so people seem to know the drill. And I did talk to another restaurant that was off camera, and they were just saying some, you know, some people really didn't know much about it, but pe but they haven't really been getting any difficult customers. They think they just, they're pretty understanding. Okay, well, it looks like people are out and about, and that's good news. Okay, thank you, Gail. Thanks, Gail.